Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would like to say thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, and who has donated to this channel. Also, thank you to everyone who has purchased a reading with me. So, this is for the sign of Virgo for the month of May, or from the time you view this video, these events could be in play. Please keep in mind it is a general reading. That means it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. So, um, this is for those of you who are interested in how an ex is feeling or thinking um, what they might be uh, planning. So, um, let's get right into this reading. We begin with the Squire of Shields, who is in the upright the way it is, is the false prophet. Um, this is somebody who comes um, pretending to be somebody they are not. Okay. I feel that, you know, frankly, I feel that we're talking about a third party. Um, so um, either they were married or you were married or already in a committed relationship. Somebody was led astray. The Banam is in the reverse on this commitment. Somebody was not being truthful, pretending to be somebody they were not. And so the wheel is in reverse. So um, somebody's wishes and, de and desires take a turn for the worse. Um, and now there is many um, doubts and uncertainties uh, <clears throat> about the future of the relationship, if there is a future at all. Um, Squire of Wisdom in the reverse can be uh, doubts and uncertainties about bad news, um, but it can also be about somebody's loyalty to you, okay? Here we have the king's two children. Now, this is um, ruled by Neptune, um, not seeing something until it's too late because this person is caught up in the illusion of a relationship, okay? So um, this is the reason that you broke up or that you are no longer uh, talking or no longer together. Um, I kind of get the feeling like it's like um, whoever feels they were the victim here is like I, I feel like you're you're on a timeout or like a break to think about things because you have just found out that this person that you thought was somebody else that you know presented themselves to you as being somebody else you find out that this person is married or you find out that they're not going to leave their wife or their family. And so this is a period of reflection because we have two cards of uh, thinking, reflecting, trying to, um, trying to find a way to fix things possibly. But at the root of it, at the bottom of it, um, this was a relationship of convenience and this person took advantage of you and you are feeling, uh, you or the, uh, actually, uh, this is for the ex, so the ex feels this way. You know, it could be that the ex confess to being married and you are feeling this way. And so now your hopes and desires have taken a turn from the wor for the worse. You've just discovered this person took advantage of you. So we have our third party relationship here again. Knight of Wands. Um, 
what is it that you know uh, you're fighting for here um, this could be you or them exactly what is it that I want um, one cup here has been set aside so one person is kind of left out and the Ten of Swords a betrayal that either they didn't see coming or uh, that you didn't see coming the result is um, you see this is about um, you know a, a warning you know that you should not have bought into somebody's story or that you shouldn't so it is possible that the offer comes back on the table because the page of cups is here but understand that you wouldn't be seeing everything with this eight of swords because you're blind and they're keeping you blind or you know it could be that you're thinking um, that you should have never bought into their story that you were blind with regards to that offer And, you know, are maybe now thinking that, well, I should just walk away from this, you know. And, and it's not because it's not something your heart wants, but you know that uh, you must do it for you. Because there doesn't appear to be any future here with this um, married person. Queen of Rods in the reverse is uh, somebody very sneaky very manipulative and um, she does things in secret and the knight of swords is um, somebody really um, they only care about themselves this is deception this person caused a lot of damage so they'd have rode in and, and rode out on again off again uh, energy with that card so here in the outcome somebody is thinking of walking away from this relationship uh, like not not uh, if you're in that timeout space where you're thinking um, that's going to be your decision is not to um, not to pick up that that third cup again because you don't want to be in a third party relationship um, you see this is third party third party relationship of convenience it's not what you want so you know it's about deciding you know what is it exactly um, that you're fighting for are you fighting for a third party relationship is that the position you want to take up always being the mistress and I feel that you don't want that and it's it's very difficult decision for you here whoever you are So there, there, you know, um, there's a possibility that an, um, because we have the offer of the page here, and we know the page never sticks around, and neither does this one. Knight of Swords in reverse. That uh, offer is going to be turned down. Thank you for watching. Many blessings. Bye for now.